These brakes are off of a 2007 Lexus LS460 and they are currently on my 2004 350Z. So to make this work you need to build adapters, use steel braided brake lines for the 350Z rotors off of a 370Z sport package, so like the Aki Bonos, and some nuts and bolts and a whole lot of patience. So like why not go with the Aki Bono kit from either like AutoZone or Z1? Well mainly because for the $1500 you would be spending to do the conversion. I can pick up the brakes for about $100 off of like a junk car at the junkyard. $100 for brake lines, $300 for rotors, $10 for brake fluid, $50 for like the 3 8 mild steel that I use for the adapters, and about $100 for various nuts and bolts and washers, angle grinding discs, stuff to make this work. Also, you won't have to grind away at your steering knuckle. I ended up buying a drill press to make the holes all beautiful and straight instead of like using a, a hand drill. And I bought the cheapest one off Amazon paired with a Harbor Freight step bit. And uh, no welding was required for the rear brackets, but for the fronts I had to do a bit, bit of welding with the Harbor Freight flux core welder, which I converted into a DC welder to get uh, better penetration. I did that with a 200 amp bridge rectifier off Amazon. So basically what I'm saying is that if you have a cheap welder, a drill press, and a little bit of know-how, uh, you could probably get this done for about half the price of an Aki Bono kit. Um, some issues I ran into at first was mainly just doing all the research, going into AutoZone, or going onto the AutoZone website and comparing a bunch of different rotors from a whole bunch of cars that use Brembo style brakes. So uh, like the Mercedes ML, S-Class, Acura TL, Toyota Tundras, and I finally found a car in the junkyard that used brake rotors with a similar offset and diameter, which was the Lexus LS460. Mainly looking for calipers that will work with like a 30 millimeter thickness and a 355 millimeter diameter for, for the front, and 28 millimeter thickness and a 350 diameter for the rear with a uh, similar rotor hats because you want to make sure the offset's not going to be too different then i had to find out if the brake lines were going to work so like from the banjo bolts to the soft lines that join to the hard line on the body so both nissan and lexus use an inverted flare connection with a, the same thread pitch uh the part that connects from the rubber to the hard line on the body as well as an M10 by one banjo bolt. Um, but I was originally using, get, planning on using the lines from the LS460 brakes, but the fronts were about a foot too short. So I ended up buying the steel braided brake lines meant for the 350Z Brembo kit, and they worked perfectly. So that was about $70, $80. Another issue I ran into was like, minor grinding since the clearances between the inside of the caliper and the outside of the edge of the rotor. Uh, so I fixed that with some small washers to uh, change the offset just slightly between the rotor and the, the caliper. And while like I was already having to bleed the whole system, I went ahead and flushed it and replaced it with some uh, DOT4 brake fluid. And then I ran the master cylinder dry, so I had to bench bleed the master cylinder, but on my car. Funny thing though, uh, both the cars use the same size and thread pitch caliper bolts, so the part that connects the caliper to the actual steering knuckle. So those were some bolts I didn't have to buy. Uh, they were different lengths, but th that ended up working in my advantage. So like the Akibono big brake kit, you have to make sure that you have some wheels that are going to accommodate the extra large brake calipers and rotors. Uh, so here I have the 18 by 9.5 plus 35 uh, offset, and those barely clear the calipers, like by millimeters. So it's going to vary depending on what wheel style, so uh, keep that in mind. There's a lot of options when you want to upgrade your brakes. I just chose the Lexus LS460 calipers just because uh, they were available and I wanted to see if they were going to work. But like lots of people have used calipers off like the SRT8s, the CTSVs, those are Brembos, um, Porsche Cayennes, which are also Brembos, but I think they're uh, 
either 17 Z's or 18 Z's in the front. But yeah, there's like a whole lot of breaks if you want to try it out. 